Warning, all of our videos are made only for educational purposes and to demonstrate scientific laws that we verify. These experiments must be supervised and we are not responsible for an incorrect execution of an experiment done by others. We do not encourage in any way that you misuse our experiments to do violent things and harm others. Hello everyone, welcome back to Chemis Podesni. Today, as always, we'll see an amazing video that Asen will tell us something about. So in this video, we are going to try to synthesize some uh, copper chloride, and with this, uh, we're going to show you something amazing uh, by mixing it with aluminium. So let's see this wonderful experiment. So we'll begin the, this video by preparing a solution of copper uh, sulfate. Uh, for this, we're going to use 15 grams uh, of copper sulfate, and uh, we are going uh, to crush them. So we crush this uh, salt because it's important to have it in uh, small pieces because in this way we can raise its superficial area and in this way we can faster our reaction. So the next part for our experiment um, is uh, to pour 60 milliliters uh, of hydrochloric acid uh, in this concentrated at 30% uh, in a beaker. Then we're going uh, to mix the two solutions in another beaker uh, and uh, let them rest for a bit. Uh, then we're going to transfer everything uh, into a conical flask. By mixing these two solutions, uh, this reaction happens. In this reaction, as you can see, uh, is formed a complex with uh, copper and uh, chloride and uh, this complex is important because uh, it's uh, our source of uh, copper chloride and so this reaction is really important to continue our experiment. We use an excess of uh, hydrochloric acid because, uh, uh, as we will see later, this uh, excess will be important because uh, it will react with aluminum foil, so it is already present in our solution. So the last part of the experiment, which is the most fascinating one, we are going to put in this conical flask, which contains our solution, some aluminum paper, and which is our common theme foil. And then we are going to see this reaction from which a gas is freed, and we are going to ignite this gas with a lighter and see a beautiful blue flame. Another reaction happens, and it's the following. As you can see from this reaction, uh, our aluminum foil that is present in a metallic form is oxidized to uh, aluminum ion and also hydrogen is produced. This hydrogen, as we all know, is a flammable gas and that's why we can ignite these uh, vapors. And also, because of the presence of uh, uh, copper chloride in our solution, this flame is green in color. Open your eyes and see. 
So guys, as always, the video is over, and in particular, we warn you to wear gloves because hydrochloric acid is really corrosive, so it could be dangerous. And also, you should do it outside or in a fumed because the gas that are produced should not be inhaled because chlorine gas could be contained in our vapors since it is present in a higher form in our solution. So be really careful with this experiment. Okay, everyone, if you like this video, please leave a the comments. And if you really want to see some more amazing experiments like this, go visit the page and subscribe to them. So, for the result, thanks for watching, guys. Ooh.